YouTube on my Gemini. Um, I'm gonna do an uh just a video on leopard geckos. Um, I cleaned their cages yesterday, but some of them went to the bathroom, so don't mind it. Corn snake messed up his cage. He's looking at me. He hates the paper towel. I gotta get him aspen bedding at the next expo. But um, yeah, just took one by one. This is the normal male. He, uh, I got him in 2011 at the December 3rd Rep Hamburg Reptile Expo in Hamburg, PA. Um, he was really skinny when I got him. Um, I still need to get him even fatter. He's at 45 grams. He doesn't look at it, look like it. But, um, I think I'll get a bunch of, uh, a thousand crickets and just feed him, uh, a lot of crickets and mealworms to get them up. Um, I want my leopard geckos to be at least 50 grams to breed. Um, in Ron Trumper's, uh, Next Generation book, I don't have it, but I heard that, uh, he said they have to be at least 45 grams, and mine is 48, but, um, he just looks too small to breed yet, even though he's two years old. But, um, nice lavender. I like the white, uh, not the white, but the stripe that goes right down. And he's just got, I have to, um, water's moist hide. But he's just got a hide with the window that he likes to sit out to get the heat. Two bowl, calcium dish, water dish, and his uh, moist hide. I'll put his thing on later. And this high yellow is from Cameron, the Reptile Man 99. Um, she is a high yellow, oh, I just did her cage and now it stinks again, because she went again. But, um, move that over. Uh, here she is, she is a high yellow. When I, um, first got her, uh, Cameron told me that her weight does go up and down. Um, and she's on the slim side right now. She's at about 35 grams. Um, she has the uh, fat glams right there, or whatever you call it, in the corner. Um, she has a little bit of keratin on her tail. Um, when I first got her, she was a really bright high yellow, and she still looks bright in the camera, but um, she's actually a darker, like a darker orange. Um, she, overall, she's really nice. I was uh, she was ovulating, and I was I uh, did try and breed her to the normal, but um, he really, oh, um, he really didn't uh like her. When I first introduced them, just to uh see what they would do, when I first got her, he would he went nuts over her, but um, now he just doesn't like her. She likes to look. Um, whoop. But, um, she has the same thing, a hive. She will be, they're actually all going to be in a rack. I have to, um, either buy or make a rack. Um, they're all going in a rack. Um, I'll have a leopard gecko breeding rack probably by May. Um, she has the same thing. A uh, hide, moist hide, calcium dish, water dish. Um, she doesn't have a food dish because when I do crickets, I just throw them in. And when I do mealworms, I just put a big pile in and she eats them like crazy. I don't have mealworms right now. So I had, I'm just giving them crickets right now. Again, he messed up his cage. Um, and then over here is the Max Snow Banded Shrimp Robino. And she went again after I cleaned her cage. Get her out. Yeah, I'll have to do the whole thing. Here she is, I'll put her in the light. And for everyone who's wondering, that's what I'm using. I'm gonna be using for uh, laying boxes, the cool whip things. 
Um, but here she is. She is also on the skinny side. Um, but that's because I just fed her the other day, so, uh, she's not that big anymore. It's weird because, and her yellow is coming in. It's weird because, um, when I do, go ahead. When I, uh, feed her, she gets nice and fat, and the next day, then she's back to skinny. And, uh, for some of you who don't know, um, she has the disorder where, uh, they don't grow very fast. Um, so, uh, really she's gonna stay that small. Um, I bought her in April, she was two weeks old, and now she's almost a year old. Um, so you can tell that she does have the disorder. But, um, it's okay. I was gonna breed her, but, you know, it's okay if you don't, if you have one just as a pet. So, um, in the next video, I'll do a video on the ball python. Um, and I do have to do a breeding plan video because, uh, I switched things around. There's new stuff that I want to breed and everything. So, um, thanks for watching. Comment, rate, and subscribe.